Because we're the thing, it's on the come up and shit, but Jack Harlow. Jack Harlow ain't on the come up. <laughs> he's, he's already popular, right? And he is. Super popular. That thing is not on the come up. But he doesn't, he has what's popping though, but like. Okay, I'm, let me go, let me go, let me go. All right. So if you're wondering why Jack Harlow just all of a sudden became a big thing, it didn't happen overnight where him going viral, which I think the the moment that literally, that made him a star wasn't What's Poppin', because What's Poppin' was out for since 2018. The remix came out a year later. The album hasn't gone gold or platinum, by the way. So What Poppin' was a record, but it, Jack Harlow was still getting referred to as being a white rapper. Like, oh, he's cool for a white guy. He had records with Bryson Tiller, he was signed to DJ Drama's, he is still signed to DJ Drama and Cannon's label, which Uzi was originally signed to. I think the moment that literally made him a star and people were like, oh shit, I, I wanna fuck with Jack Harlow was him pulling up on Sweetie. And putting his hand over her palm and be like, yo, am I making you nervous? That moment you realize, like, yo, Jack Harlow is really that cool, that cool guy. Like, yo, he can pull up on anyone and just like, damn, Jack Harlow, Jack Harlow really him. Cause mind you, before that, he had the Tyler Hero record and that didn't do anything. And shout out to Wonder, because he produced that. But that record was just mid. Like people were fucking with it because it's like, oh, it's Jack Harlow. But now his shit's getting like he gets he's on TikTok. He has the the complex magazine. What's the what's that comedian's name? I'm forgetting. Drewski? He's a meme. Drewski. They are the cover of complex and shit. Jack Harlow's getting all these looks. And again, what's popping is literally three years old. He's literally dropped an album that has like no big hits on there. I think it's a record with Chris Brown and shit. So it's insane that I honestly believe it wasn't his music. Okay, the music got him got him to here, but it was really that one incident with Sweetie that changed the whole perspective on Jack Harlow and shit, bro. And shout out to Cannon and them for working and what they're doing. Cause like Jack Harlow is really moving like a star now, bro. I mean, I think even moving and like a star is what's popping out. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that's the incident that that internet went viral on Twitter. I don't know if that internet went viral everywhere else. He's popping like his music is a lot of spin on the radio. I'll tell you that. I hear that shit in Ubers. Tyler here and Industry Baby with Lil Nas X, but. Uh, but that's way after though. That's in 2021. What's popping came out in 2018. Yeah, and that's, but yeah, but it wasn't. Pop, what's popping when lived on until like last year. It's not like it's not like the song died. It. it <laughs> like it's it's the one that made him into Jack Harlow. No matter when it came out, it was rocking in 2020 through the pandemic, and it was rocking in 2021 kinda. Tell a hero was Bro. a dud. Industry Baby's fire. The rest of his music is cool. If we can, if <laughs> to mediocre. He raps on like on on on. I think he has a record. He does have a record. It's called River Road. He reminds me of an early Drake, like comeback season Drake. Now, mind you, what does that mean? Because Mamba, what you always say about comeback season? Oh, that's the worst Drake. That's that. That's just <laughs> that is like oh maybe he has potential, but it's the worst lyrical Drake in right. dancing. And that's what I see in Jack Harlow. So I don't know what that means. Either he can be the next uh, Drake, <laughs> or he can be. <laughs> All right. Okay. All you... <laughs> Industry baby is a feature. I see. I see this. Rich homie Quan could have still been popping. It's just the fact that his label issues, and then when he tried to get back on, he he rubbed a lot of people the wrong way. He really he rubbed Thug the wrong way, and I feel like Thug fucked with everyone, so I feel like that kind of did hinder him. And then he went on the whole independent route. But Rich homie Quan is mad talented. Designer, he was a one, he was he was a one trick pony. Though. I don't know. He, he literally sounded like Future, like, for being honest. Jack Harlow can go hollow at Miley Cyrus. Miles Cyrus' first album, man. Man, I haven't heard this song in a minute. Wait, you know this song? Uh, like, what are we talking about? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I 